Hey guys, so today um we're gonna be doing we're gonna be playing with makeup. Yay! So um I started playing with some makeup before I started filming, so um I just thought well I should just film it instead. So we're gonna be playing with um some makeup that I just got that I ordered like a freaking month ago and I'm just now getting it and also gonna be eating some cookies because I'm on my period and my girl is craving chocolate so I'm just gonna have a chill day and play with some makeup <sighs> I got a few things I got and this is not all the stuff I got from Wish so I'm probably gonna split this into two parts when I get the rest of the of my makeup because I still have some coming but I got two of my little thingies from, um, what is this called? From Wish, yeah. And it's just some, like, glitter eyeshadow, glitter eyeliner. And these lashes I got from Amazon. In case if you're wondering, I got these on Amazon. They're really cute. I really like them. Um, I think that this one is coming off, though, so I'm gonna fix it. So, got some like some glitter, little eyeshadows, and then I got these lipsticks from Amazon, which I actually have already tried these, but thought I would show you guys them since I like they're so like brand new. I just got them maybe yesterday. Um, and then I got some stuff from Mac. You guys, I'm super excited. And I'm in a really like scrunched up space right now. I decided to sit on the floor and just, you know, be cute like that and film from the floor. And I'm also, I'm really sorry, I'm sitting right next to a vent. So if you guys hear the air conditioner, I'm so sorry. It's probably loud as hell, but I can't control what the vents are, you know. So yeah, so I got some stuff from Mac. I'm like real, real excited. And, um, yeah, so I think that's all the makeup that I have. So, just like with Mac, came with, like, this little card. You give $10, you get $10. Basically, if you, like, invite your friends, then, like, you get $10 off. So, um, yeah, just, like, a little card. And I feel like it came with, like, another card or something, but I don't remember. And then this was a little sample I picked. It's just their setting spray. Um, it refreshes skin and improves wear of makeup for 12 hours. So it's just like the cute little sample spray. Like that's so cute. Like if you like played with dolls or something. I don't play with dolls and this is also just like really worth that. But like if you like played with dolls or something, this would be like the perfect size for like a cute little doll or something. Um, so yeah. <laughs> So I started playing with like some of the foundations and the lip and the lipsticks and stuff. Um, but I haven't tried them on my skin, so that's why I'm not wearing any makeup so I can show you like my first impressions when I actually like um put it on my face and stuff. So <sighs> but these lipsticks, I will show you guys what these lipsticks looks look like on my hand. Sorry, my boyfriend was calling me. Um, I don't even know where I left off. I was talking about these. I don't even remember, like, what I was going to say. But anyways, so these are the ones I got on Amazon. They are the NYX Professional. And, um, I'm going to just let you see why I have some issues with these. But so this first one is in the color Madrid. She's getting on my nerves right now. So, um. This one is Madrid. It looked really pretty online. It was like this like darkish like pink color. I don't really remember it being like it was like a between like red and pinkish color. And so this is what it looks like on my hand. It's whoa. It's really pretty, but I feel like it mostly just looks like kind of red, you know. They go on like pretty nice and these are only like $4 each. So the formula is like really nice for them to be so cheap and then i really like this color too this is prog 
I really like this color. Like, I don't think it looked like this online, like the swatch, but I still really like it either way. Like, this is what it looks like. It's just really pretty pink color. I love, 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 love how it looks. I just, like, I don't think I've had a pink lipstick this color before. And then this next one is Monte Carlo. I love this color. It's just such, like, this is deep red color. Oh, my God. And I'm sh gonna show you what it looks like in comparison to the MAC swatch. They're both, you know, they pretty much look the same, but it's still wet, so you'll see what it looks like when it dries. But um, I definitely like the MAC formula way better. It just goes on a lot like more opaque, whereas you kind of have to keep applying layers of this. But like I said, for the price, I think they're really pretty. It's just like the problem that I have is that these two colors look like the same exact color, where this is supposed to be more of a reddish pinkish but it just looks red and it looks like the same color and then plus like you see what i mean like they don't look that different whereas this looked like a more of a, a pinkish color online but in person it just looks red and that's what kind of like irritates me and then this color irritates me the most. Um, this is in Copenhagen because the swatch looked more like how the color looks in the bottle. But then when you put it on, it looks nothing. It looks nothing like this. It looks absolutely nothing like this. And I didn't go based off of what, what it looked like in the bottle. I went based off of what it looked like on the swatch. And the swatch resembled like how the bottle looks. So I was like, oh my God, like that's such a pretty deep color. And then I put it on and it's like, that looks nothing like this. Nothing like, nothing like it. And, um, I just like I just really wish it was like that deeper color because I was so excited because I don't have any matte lipsticks that are like that color that dark color so that's what like oh, it just it made me so upset because I was so excited about that color that in Madrid I was like really excited about so I'm like really upset but this color um Mac the dance with me you guys you guys I love a classic red lipstick and this red is so perfect like because you know I'm a way deeper skin tone so I have to find the right shade of red otherwise it's gonna look like orange on me so this color is perfect for my deep my deep skin tone melanated queens out there um, it looks so pretty I feel like this will look pretty on all skin tones though just because it's such a deep rich red but like if you're looking for like a good red and you have a deep deeper skin tone my love then this is the color for you so I'm really excited to see what's gonna look like on like my lips I'm real real excited so those are all the lip colors um sorry. I'm just trying to get like more comfortable so because I'm in such like a scorch scrunched up place and like i don't want my legs to like fall asleep so if i keep fidgeting and moving um that's why i'm gonna eat a cookie so the next thing i got um well let me show you what these sparkly colors look like because i haven't swatched these yet so i don't know what they look like so i got these like cool like glitter eyeliners so that um instead of me having to use a lash glue that's like this and then apply glitter on top of it because i just find that doing that can take a really long time and be really annoying so i just wanted to get the ones that are already come in like a glitter tube and you can just paint it on and there you go so i got a few of these this one is blue obviously that's what it looks like coming out i'm kind of scared because i don't know what they're gonna look like just because you know it's from wish so who knows what it's gonna look like but Oh, okay. That's actually not bad. 
That's not bad. It's not showing up on camera. There we go. The only thing is you like you have to make that one line perfect because if you have to go back over it, then you're going to like mess it up. But when you just do like one swipe, it's so opaque. Like that's so pretty. So that's what the blue one looks like when I want to do like a really pretty like blue look. Which I don't wear blue eyeshadow a lot. I don't really wear eyeshadow a lot. Well, I mean, I'm not going to say I don't wear eyeshadow, but I wear a lot of neutral colors. And I want to start like playing more with colors. So, um, that's why I got these. This one is in pink. These actually are not bad, you guys. To be from Wish. Because Wish is sketchy. These are really pretty. I'm really excited to use these. Like, these are perfect for, like, a cut crease. And you want to, like, add that little streak of eyeliner. Ooh, you guys. Uh, also, like... I feel like with these, you can't do like a thick ass layer or it's gonna dry like really bumpy and lumpy. Like, see how that's drying? Oh god, it's actually kind of hard to get off. Ah! Um. But yeah, these are really pretty. I really like these, like, and they're so sparkly and pigmented. Girl. I see you wish, okay? I see you come through. You don't always have to get you some high quality makeup. I'm gonna call my boyfriend, so if you see me, um, if you hear him talking, it's cool, whatever. It's um you know, it's a it's a little vlog type anyway, so I don't think you guys are gonna care if I talk to my boyfriend while I'm playing in makeup. I'm gonna just telling him that I'm filming though. If he answers the damn phone. Hey babe. Hey babe. Um, I'm just filming by the way too, so if you hear me like talking, I'm not talking to myself. I'm doing a vlog, just so you know. No babe, you can talk to me, but I'm just saying like I'm also vlogging, so that's all. I don't want you to feel like weird or anything. Oh, I'm not. So what is this vlog gonna be over like you just like trying all those like- Yeah, I'm just stuff. like literally just playing makeup and like I'm about to try it on my face to see what it looks like on my face. Okay. Yeah, it looks good. Thanks. The frontal was like making me mad so I just put a headband on so that you just can't see it. I swear. I love you, Kafkas. I love you too. Okay, so what do I want to show you guys now? Okay, yeah, so we're gonna move on to the face stuff. Um so I got the foundation, the um Studio Fix Fluid SPF broad spectrum foundation in the color nt50 which this color also looked a lot different online like it looked way darker and then like <sighs> this matches the high points on my face but girl and then look at the the concealer so i got the pearl long wear concealer which i love this concealer i used used to use this back in the day i think when i was in like high school and it it lasted me like a long time because like I it looks so little, but if you use Mac, you know, girl, like a little bit of this goes a long way. So these gonna last you like a long time. But hold on, my leg is falling asleep. So this my concealer is darker than my foundation. 
like where they do that at so I don't know if I just want to put on my concealer first and then like in the spots where I usually conceal and then just put my foundation on top or if I just all together want to use my concealer as my foundation and my foundation as my concealer <sighs> which I don't even know if that makes any sense but concealer is usually supposed to go underneath your foundation anyways like that's just how it used to be but like ever since contouring and highlighting got like bigger the game kind of changed and now people put concealer on top of their foundation like including myself so i don't know how i want to do it i guess i'm just gonna see what it looks like on my face because my hand is kind of a different skin tone than my face so i'm just gonna go ahead and see what they look like side by side like where i usually highlight and just see what it looks like and see what i want to do from there so i'm gonna go get my beauty blender right quick and i'll be back okay y'all so we're gonna see what this looks like and it's funny because i'm sitting in front of my mirror like the whole premise of me sitting here on the floor was because a i wanted to just be on the floor and be cute and be relatable and then oh yeah these eyelashes are from mag too and then um also because i wanted to be in front of my mirror but now i'm using this mirror so it's like i should have i could have just sat on my table but at the same time like everything is on the floor so it kind of just worked out but it's whatever so just go ahead and put the foundation on and see what it looks like because it blended into my hand pretty well but my hand is lighter than my face so i just hope that it blends in on my face because if not i'm just gonna have to use it as a um as a concealer I feel like that just blended into my face with like no problem. Cause the only reason I got the N250 was because. Oh my Jesus. Was because um, it's for golden undertones and obviously I, you guys can see I have golden undertones on my face. Like yellow golden undertones. I also have some red though as well. But I feel like the one that had more red undertones was like too red. So it would have just made me look orange. So I went ahead and went with the golden undertones because I feel like I have more golden undertones in my face than I do red. But this seems to be working like I wouldn't say it's my exact, my exact skin tone, like to a T. I feel like the Fenty Beauty, um, the, what color is that? I think like the 44. I think that one is like my exact shape, like my exact shape. Um, like even in the summer, like it, it fits me. But I feel like this one, this foundation would work for me in the winter when like the sun's not really out and and stuff but i feel like for the summer this definitely like i can't get away with wearing this even though like i haven't really been outside like that anyways but like see like you can just kind of see like it is a little light for me But I don't think that it's horrible. I don't know. Like, see, 
it's obviously not exactly my skin tone so let's see what the concealer looks like you only for real need like one pump of this shit i kid you not like their concealer is off the chain I feel like even this concealer is not my color. <laughs> but this concealer has more like red undertones than it does golden undertones. So this one brings out more of the red undertones in my face and this one brings out more of the yellow undertones in my face. You see? The only thing is like, I don't really know how I feel about wearing concealer as foundation. I mean, I don't really matter. Like, it doesn't really matter. There's no rules when it comes to makeup, so you can honestly wear whatever you want as whatever you want. So I basically got the opposite for myself. This is the color that I should have gotten concealer and this is the color that I should have gotten foundation. But at the same time, I don't really wear foundation anyways. Like you guys know in my videos, like when I, my makeup videos, um, I'm sorry, my legs are falling asleep again. Like this was not a good idea. This is like a good idea in like thought, but not an execution. So y'all know that i don't really like to wear foundation anyways so i may just end up using the concealer like on an everyday basis and probably never wear this foundation <laughs> just being completely honest Just cause like, I don't know. Oh, I got too much. I think I'm just gonna end up putting this face because then I'll actually be my skin tone. Either way though, this fucking concealer and foundation makes my skin look absolutely amazing. And I'm gonna get my neck too, cause I can't stand when people's neck and face doesn't match. Hi, babe. Yeah, I just made a pizza. It took like 10 minutes, so yeah, I'm just getting good. I swear. If somebody made a vlog like that, I would not watch it. <laughs> so. I think I'm gonna use. Did I put the lid back on? Yeah. So I think uh -huh. I'm gonna use this as my highlighter even though it's foundation because like now i look kind of orange which is like why i said earlier why i don't like foundations that have more red undertones because then 
I just look at I look I end up looking orange because I only have a little bit of red undertones in my face not a lot See, like that looks way better than this as my foundation. Uh huh, oh. that looks way better. I just need one chance to get inside your pants. I swear. Did you just make <laughs> that up or is that on something? <laughs> no, I just made it up. I swear. And this doesn't show my dry ass skin on my nose. Mmm, <sighs> my skin looking like butter. <laughs> it is, look. What, you talking to me? Oh, me? Okay. Oh, oh, I'm trying to get it to face me, but this shit doesn't stand up unless it's like literally leaning against something. There we go. My legs fucking hurt. They're falling asleep again because I'm in this crunched ass space. <gasps> I love this foundation. Like. Bitch, I'm glowing, I'm glowing. Okay. So, what else do I want to try on my face? Um. Babe, try that new foundation that makes your skin glow. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm going to get there. Hold on. Oh yeah, by the way, so I got a fan. I love this thing. And I already got it down. So, I'm really happy. I hope you stop yourself with this. <laughs> okay, so moving on. Um, what do we want to try? Maybe I do want to try the setting spray. Yeah, I think I am going to try that actually. Oh, okay, so I'm really excited about this one, you guys, because it's the finish. It's so pretty. This one is the Fix Plus Gold Light. And it's the set, it's still a setting spray. But girl, I seen this and how it looked like on the models. And then I like read the reviews. And everybody was like, yes, girl, like buy it, go ahead and buy it. And they have fun like um, I think it's in pearl. It's like in pearl or some shit. It's like pink. So if you're like lighter or maybe you just want like pearl color, then that one's really pretty too. But this one's gold. And I think the pearl one was sold out anyways and I didn't want to wait. So I seen gold and I was like, ah, I'm a copy. <laughs> what? <laughs> so yeah, okay. So I'm really excited to see what this one's gonna look like. Mmm, it smells good too. Um, but yeah, you don't want to spray too much or you're gonna look like a disco ball, so. I 
feel like I can't really tell on my face as good as I could on my hand. I'm gonna spray some more. So pretty. Mm -hmm. This is like perfect for the summer. Like, bitch. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Look at that bronze skin. Oh. You could like spray it in a specific area too, like. Not like that. But if you wanted like extra like highlight or something. It's like all oh, fucking. Where's my beauty blender? But like if you wanted like that extra. Oh, bitch. Oh, that looks so good. I don't even really use setting spray anyways because I feel like it doesn't make a difference. Like if you have on good quality makeup, I feel like it's going to stay on regardless. But these are just fun just because I'm like they help make it last even longer. And if I like don't want a glittery shimmer finish, then I can just use this cute little sample too. If I just want like a regular finish. And I can't feel my motherfucking calves, shins knees butt cheeks this feels really good too shit i might even use this when i'm not doing my makeup that is so fucking gorgeous gorgeous darling okay so i'm gonna try this lip liner which i'm really excited about because it went on so smooth on my hand so i can't wait to see what it looks like on my lips let me get some of this Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh, this goes on so pretty. Oh. I don't have to like draw super hard, like it just goes on. This is in the color Vino, by the way, so. I like it cause it's not like brown, but it's not like exactly burgundy either. It's just a good neutral color to use with like nudes, bright colors, like I love it. And I'm really excited about this lipstick because y'all, this, uh, like I said, is in the color Dance With Me. So I'm really excited to see what this going to look like. Oh my god this goes on so smooth
bitch. Great, and I already got it on my teeth. I swear, how does this get on your teeth like that? Oh my god, you guys. You guys, do you see how this looks right now? And do you see how fast it dries? I am shook it right now. I am shook it. Not just shook, I'm shook it. I'm shook it right now. This lip liner, this lipstick. I'm about to just start getting all of my lipsticks from MAC from now on. I don't care that their lipsticks are like $20, $30. I don't care, okay? I don't care. Because do y'all see how this looks right now? Do y'all see how this looks right now? Like, are you seeing this? Like, I thought that I just loved their face products. Girl, no. I'm about to start getting all my lipsticks from MAC. I don't give a fuck how expensive they are. Because it obviously is worth it. Like, my lips look fucking like a million dollars right now. I had to go back in with my eyeliner to enhance my beauty marks because my makeup covered them. I have a lot of beauty marks on my face, plus my freckles. I got one on my neck too, where is it? Right here. I just got a lot of beauty marks. Oh, my legs, my legs, my legs. I'm like about to just lay down. <laughs> I'm so cramped up right now. Okay. You guys, you guys, I'm feeling, I'm living for this makeup right now. There's no cracks. There's no anything in my lips. It's not super drying. The formula, the formula, like whatever formula they have in their lipstick, keep it, don't ever change it. Babe, shut the fuck up. Bitch, like, I, I don't even need to say anything. You can just look at it. You can just look at it. Like, this make me wanna like, get ready now. <laughs> <laughs> it looks so pretty, but like I'm not gonna do that because I don't have any reason to. I think I'm gonna add some of this pink glitter because it's so pretty. I don't know how I want to add it though. I don't know if like I just wow, want to put it so in like my inner corners or like what I want to do with it. Or I could put it like underneath my lash line. It's just so pretty, like. Ew, now I'm getting it on my top lashes. Oh, okay, okay. Just don't get it in your fucking eye, like. That's the last thing I need. This is so 
and it dries once it dries you guys it's really good like it doesn't smudge it doesn't come off on my finger it's like on there girl i'm about to have some fun with these because i love glitter but do y'all see my lips right now i'm obsessed i'm obsessed with my lips okay guys so i think i'm done i really like i really like what i got so far um like i said i'm probably gonna make a part two when i get the rest of my stuff um but this is just what i got today and like what i got maybe like yesterday i showed y'all my other eyeshadow palette in my other video so um yeah like just i hope this inspires somebody to be like bitch now i want some makeup because i love makeup i love playing in makeup <laughs> so yeah so um let me stop saying so i'll see you guys in my next video i'll see you in part two so you can see what else i got and um yeah i love you guys thanks for watching peace